Well, good afternoon, everyone. It is a special day here at the Clearwater Marine Aquarium. Super special. You saw Stubby, our green sea turtle, 16th year anniversary since he came to the Clearwater Marine Aquarium. I'm here with Becca, our turtle biologist, is going to take you through his story and tell you about the great care that uh, Stubby gets here. Becca? Yeah. So as you're saying, Bill, uh, this is Stubby. This is our super sweet 16 rescue anniversary. She came to us on May 9th of 2001 and Florida Wildlife Research Institute actually brought her to our facility. Now you'll notice something a little different about Stubby's appearance compared to the other turtles at Mavis's Rescue Hideaway. She's missing her front flippers completely. This is due to monofilament entanglement. So if anyone's heard of fishing line, monofilament's just a fancy word for it. And it was wrapped so tightly around both of her front flippers that her flippers basically sloughed off, very similar to Winter's story. So this requires us to keep her as a permanent resident because otherwise she wouldn't be able to forage and survive on her own out in the wild. So here at Mavis's Rescue Hideaway, she shares a habitat with uh, five other sea turtles, as you can see. Um, and what we're doing right now is we're doing a target training session. Basically, we have to administer their food and their medication, but target training allows it to be a lot uh, less stressful on the animals because they have their own zones. And our trainers here have some very important tools they're using to do that. The first is the target. So that's the thing you see with a black hole and they have their own distinguished um, paddle at the very end. Each turtle has their very own target distinguished by different shape and colors. So that's how they know theirs from their neighbor. The other important tool our trainers have is what's on their wrist, which is a standardized dog clicker. And this dog clicker serves as the bridge between the behavior, which is touching the target, and receiving their reinforcement, which you're gonna see Catherine giving Stubby right now, which is lettuce. Now, some of our residents here at the Clearwater Marine Aquarium love primary reinforcement, which is food. That's something you can't live without. But our turtles here also like secondary reinforcement, which is called tactile in layman's terms. So instead of maybe giving Stubby a piece of food on her next target, we might actually scratch her back, which she especially loves kind of around her butt area. And for this special day, we're actually going to be giving her an extra piece of reinforcement, also not essential to life, but it's something interesting and new to our environment. It's called an ice toy. And today on the menu, it's a mixture of ice and a spiral zucchini. Spiral zucchini, mm -hmm. it sounds pretty good. It's her favorite. It's her favorite. So <laughs> what we'll do now, oh, we see uh, this is Eula. Eula yep, so Eula up. is um, one of our little vacuum cleaners of the habitat. She will go after the littlest piece of lettuce or zucchini or avocado. So we are about rescue, rehab, and release. Uh, you can see for, uh, for the reasons that uh, Becca indicated, we're their forever home. And boy, are they getting some great care restaurant quality food, some TLC from our staff and our volunteers and our interns. Thank you guys so much for all the work that you're providing. I think, Becca, I think this would be a good time. We get birthday cakes on our anniversaries, but Stubby's gonna get this special ice treat with some fish and zucchini in it. There we go. Now she will probably have to share with some of our other residents because they do all love the ice toys, but who doesn't like to share cake on their birthday? For sure. Exactly, I mean, except for me. And my sister, that's a little different. <laughs> you was like, yes, birthdays. <laughs> oh, I'm <laughs> sure. <laughs> like we said, she is our vacuum cleaner, so if you leave it, she'll get it. And this is a great behavior to see her do because Catherine reintroduced her target and Stubby came right back to engage with the target. Well, I hope you love these turtles as much as we do. Thank you so much for tuning in, Becca. Great job, team, great job. Uh, check us out on seawinter.com. There is a webcam, the Mavis Rescue Hideaway webcam. You can check that or better yet, come see us here in Clearwater, Florida. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Bye.